<laughs> Great fucking way to start off a video. Hey guys, Alex Felton here, and welcome back to Spore. If you notice, kinda in a, you know, a different recording setup, and that's because you know, we've, we've been doing some stuff around the house, we've been moving shit around, clearing shit out, you know, there's a whole bunch of stuff going on. And one of those things, clearing a space in this room that was originally going to be used for art, but that I commandeered for a recording setup. Uh, yeah. But, you know, it may, like, all you're seeing is just this. This is actually a painting right here that's stacked in front of other paintings. You can see here, look at all, all this. Yeah, it's been stuffed on either side and precariously stacked. Like, look at where I'm sitting right now. Okay. You got all this stuff up here, and there's like some old pictures and stuff. Actually, oh my god. It's actually my baby handprints and footprints. And a picture of me as an infant. So yeah, whole lot of memories, whole lot of old stuff here. A little look into my history that you never knew about. But yeah, we're back with Spore and I'm excited because I'm not gonna be messing around with the creature creator today. Today, we're actually going to be going into a legitimate world. Starting from the cell and going right to the top. Now last time we were doing the carnivorous route which is where we start off as a carnivore, we just go around and kill shit, we eat it, and and we basically just progress down, well, if you're playing Undertale, it would be called the genocide route. Today, we're flipping that on its head and going the pacifist route. So we're starting off as a herbivore, we're gonna be a complete pussy throughout the entire game. Let's get started. These are some worlds that I said a while ago that I saved, that they have blue water on them. It's specifically for this purpose. And also, you may notice, on some headphones. These are a steal, okay? They were $7 at Salvation Army. Some poor bastard probably gave these up, probably had better headphones than these, which is hard to imagine. Oh god, these are awesome. Eh, no. Let's go into this one. Herbivore! Ew. Fucking, eh. Oh. Ew, Jesus. Yeah, sure. It's freaky. It's weird. It's just like me. Uh, Hidel Terror. <laughs> I swear, the devs for this game come up with like the weirdest names for stuff. Hidel Terror as a planet. That's just amazing. Alright, back in the tide pool. Alright. So we're back again, just going around collecting plants to eat some juices out of. I, I don't know why it took me so long to record another video. I was just... Because here's the thing, I said it once, fuck off, and I'll say it again, alright? Before I record a video, I just think to myself, I'm gonna be recording another video. And, but I got all this shit to do first. And then once I actually get into it, I'm thinking, why am I procrastinating? I love the feeling of recording videos, but just before it, I'm just like, ah, and I don't know why. It's borderline retarded of me. Oh yeah, there's a big guy. And also, if you have um, gone to the channel homepage recently, and you just checked out the top of the page, you'll notice there's some new banner art. Yeah, I made that. It's just really a design concept. I wanted to like uh, ride on the coattails of the uh, the fiery cat that I actually have for the logo, and I'm like, so okay, how can I make the fiery cat better? Because obviously the fiery cat is cut off at the top and bottom and like on the sides, and I couldn't find a picture that was anything other than that. I couldn't find like a full cat head to work with, so I'm just like, well, that just sucks. So. I went around looking for tigers made of fire, and I eventually set, on, set upon, well, they're called cheetahs, but they don't look like cheetahs. They have cheetah spots, but they gotta be a leopard or a jaguar. I'm gonna go with leopard. Yeah, and that was the banner art for the channel, and I plan 
on, in the near future, making an end screen, too. And the reason I haven't done this earlier is simply for the fact that I don't have Photoshop on my computer. I honestly, I just don't. And the reason for that is, I'm going to tell you a little story, is because for Christmas, I got, uh, I got my recording camera. I got, oh, God. I'm not sick, I swear to God. Um, I got my camera, I got the SD card that goes with it, and I got Adobe Premiere Elements, which I used to cut together these videos with. Now, in the box, it also said it had Adobe Photoshop Elements, and I thought, well, that's great. Then I can make thumbnails, I can make end screens, I can, you know, I can do all sorts of shit. <laughs> the thing is, it's only a 30-day free trial. In order to get the full thing, you have to actually go out and buy Photoshop Elements. And so I'm thinking, oh, okay. So instead of actually putting together the end screen here at home, which would be easy, I actually do that at school in media arts class when I have free time. So yeah, I do have an outro song now that I went out and found. I'll tell you what it is in a future video. <laughs> If I even put it in this one, if I even remember. Yeah, so just look forward to that in the future. I have rambled on far too fucking long. It's time to be pussies. What the fuck was that? I'm wondering why I'm not moving fast enough, and it's because I haven't, you know, evolved yet. Let's see what we can do. Welcome to Dr. Felton's plastic surgery. Our rusty scalpels and dirty fingernails are at your disposal. <laughs> oh no. Why? Alright. Now let's uh, name our species. Our species shall be called... Hmm. Squiddy Mick Squitterton. Squiddy Mick Squitterton. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's just too silly. Uh, ooh. Let's give it a nice squidly looking paint job. Color is a squid. Nice red. Ooh. Ooh. That's a nice squid color. Alright. Come on, Squiddy McSquidderton. We have plants to eat. Oh, yes, this is so much more maneuverable. Well, it's a lot faster. Maneuverability is still at an all time low. Fuck off! Thank you for eliminating my competition. Would you all kindly, collectively, and in an, in an orderly fashion, fuck yourselves? Alright, well, at least you're in my species, so. Uh huh. Alright. Alright, well, we're quite a bit bigger now. Ah! Ow. Is that the sound the big guys make? They're just like... Alright, let's go into the cell creator. I've gotten sufficiently big. Stop it. No. Alright. Alright, so just a quick refresher. Um, I've put Celia on the front of it. Oh, let's actually make those bigger. Alright, so I put Celia on the front of it, 
and I've added two spikes in the back so that if anyone tries to Jared Fogle me, right the fucking face. Ah, oh, I'm so stoked. What's in this stuff anyway? Come on, Squiddy McSquitterton, Mark Two. All right. Now the plant pieces stop getting bigger. Ooh, I can actually eat those little black things. Prevent any more juniors from spawning. Yes! We have developed a central system of neural synapses. A brain. Now, let's see what we can do about turning it into an actual functioning creature. I want to know if I can be ever so sneaky. I have an idea, but I don't know if I have the funds to cover it. Yeah, yeah, I do have the funds to cover it. What am I talking about? <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. If you ever, ever wanted to know what Ned Flanders looked like on acid, this is it. <laughs> oh. No, actually, I got I, I have a different name for it, but if if I wasn't going through with this plan, that's what I would name it: Ned Flanders on acid. <laughs> uh, all right, so I'll be back when I'm finished it. Mm -hmm. Ladies and germs, I give you the hoverbug. Look at this fucking thing. It's like. It's kind of like if the helicopter, it's like if the flying machine from the movie Oblivion was an animal, it'd be this. Look at it. So it's got like these things for upward propulsion, this one for forward propulsion. Alright, now let's give it a, a land creature paint job. And yep. Oh yeah. Yeah, he's, he's, he's enjoying that. Nothing left to do but go out into the world and eat as many plants as absolutely possible. Huh. They actually move decently fast. What I get? What? Ooh, Gobstalker. Right. Ow. Now, when that opening thing comes up, the game expects you to. What it's expecting you to do is every single time you get a new part, you go in and you make a new creature. That's what it's just. That's what it's just implying there, but that's not what we're gonna do. All right. All right. Since we're pussies. Come on. Okay. You know, as adorable as this creature is, I think it's. I'm gonna have to consign it to the scrap. Why do we keep taking these off? They gotta like. Is there tape around here that I can use to stick these on my head with? Yeah. Well, like, I'm probably just, like, in the future when I'm editing this video, I'm probably just gonna, like, leave one mating scene in there. I'll probably just have, like, a compilation with, like, Marvin Gaye in the background. <laughs> I should have gone the omnivore route. I, I should have. I should have. Should have done it. How disgusting! Like that could that could not be like a more unappealing noise. <laughs> You know what, let's try and make as adorable a little herbivorous creature as we can out of this. You know, let's, let's make a pig. Let's make a striped pig, because at least that sounds like it should. Like, here, if we take this. 
See, that's that sounds like it should. At least it sounds better than the fucking mole rat. Jeez. So, now we have the deformed love child of Kermit the Frog and Miss Piggy. The jump pig. Because it can... It can jump. The jump pig. Awesome. J no, just awesome. Oh, and I forgot I gave it little stripes. Oh, that's cute. Alright, jump it. Wow. That's actually that's actually pretty fast. Alright. Wow, that was a that was eventful. Who's me, Mr. Bean? May I ally you? Yay! Easy. Wow. Yay! Brain power. These are all easy because I have Sing level 2. Ooh. Snortle. It's a nice, uh, it's a nice honker we got. Come on. What about you? You ain't got nothing going for you except sing. Easy stuff. These are all layup creatures. And. Bone sauce! Alright, let's go home. Alright. Now let's just alter the jump pig slightly. So now we have jump two. And we have dance two. Everything's just coming up twos today. Uh, yeah, we got sing. And jump. And we got charm. Alright, actually not too bad. Perfect! See? There we go. Alright, now. Uh, how much time? We have nine minutes. That's a... That's enough to ally to... Oh. It's a little piggy exodus. Oh, boy. Alright. May as well follow the back. Yay! Now I saw an awesome part here. No wait, eh. Try to get it, get it, get it. Eh, Chuffle. That's a, that's a dog nose. If I wanted to make a dog, I would do so. But no. Oh, what kind of mouth have we got? Sounder snout. This adorable pig face, but it is no matter.
we'll call it Mad Pig. Is this pig? Oh, he's angry. Oh, I forgot. I'm gonna add nostrils on him, otherwise he's gonna suffocate. And with that, I am gonna leave this episode here. So, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and thanks for being here.